me, Nadja from NadjaDiamond.com, coming to you today with a June favorites video. So, I um, haven't done a favorites video in a while. I don't even know if I've ever done a favorite video. Actually, a favorites video. <laughs> so, I wanted to come to you guys and let you know some products that I'm really, really loving this month. Um, June has been just kind of like a great month. It went by so quickly. It actually was my birthday month so happy birthday to me yay so yeah and I picked up a few things and I just wanted to go ahead and share with you guys what it is that I'm loving for this month so anyway jump right into it um in the summertime I have pretty oily skin and I have been on the hunt for products and Oddly enough, I have been playing with makeup a lot more here in the summertime, which is crazy because normally I do like the real simple kind of neutral eye looks. And like today, if you guys can see, I'm doing like this really like cool like uh, purple and like pink on in the crease and on kind of like on the outer V with a little bit of glitter and these huge lashes. So yeah I've been having a lot of fun with my makeup this summer so far so anyway I picked up this oil control lotion from MAC and I have been loving this because it really does control the oil in my face and it really does um, kind of help me maintain a, a matte kind of uh, finish instead and get oily less quickly that makes any sense so yeah I've been loving this the oil control lotion um, has kind of been like um a godsend for me also <laughs> you guys this is a monostat chafing gel and i actually use this as a foundation primer so yes um this it has only gone on my face please like don't worry but um <laughs> the chafing gel actually acts as a really good oil feed primer so um it helps like keep your makeup on and i actually learned this from i want to say it was makeup geek tv on youtube also on youtube where she shared this tip for using the monostat chafing powder um and so yeah i absolutely love it and it's been a favorite of mine so um i want to hit to go ahead and include that um also i have been loving this is the tea tree water from lush um and this is actually a toner but i use it as like a uh, finishing powder finishing powder a finishing spray uh, when I do my makeup and I just use it to kind of set my makeup in place um, and I really like it because it has um, reviving great for and I also use it kind of like as a refresher throughout the day to kind of just kind of put life back into my makeup um, it's a reviving grapefruit uh, juniper berry and tea tree toner um, and this is effective but gentle on oily, spotty, and normal skin. So it's actually, I also use it as a toner at night after I wash and cleanse my face. And I use, put it on like a little, um, one of these like little cotton rounds. And just go over my face to make sure I got all of the makeup off. So it's also good for that. So this I am absolutely loving. You can pick this up at Lush. It was $8.95. Um, also, my absolute favorite scent for the summertime, and I know I'm going to say it wrong, but it is the Ange ou Duman uh, Givenchy uh, perfume, and I just, like, love it. I don't know. I can't even um, really dis describe the scent of it. It's just, like, lovely. So, it's Ange ou Duman. Ange ou Duman. Um... And it's uh, Givenchy, and you can find it at Ulta. And I picked it up probably like in January, and I haven't really started because I have so many perfumes. I haven't really started really using it until um, the summertime. And it is almost, it has not replaced, but it is kind of neck and neck with my uh, Victor and Rolf Flower Bomb. Uh, for bronzers, I'm going to have to say I am loving... NYX bronzer and this is Daydream of Oahu um, and this is in BB02 if you guys can see that um, and I ordered this on Holtlook.com I also love the let me show you guys kind of what that looks like that's what it looks like it's just like a normal regular bronzer and it doesn't have a lot of shimmer in it. It just kind of gives you like a nice glow. I also picked up the Rimmel London Natural Bronzer and this is in a 027 Sundance. Um, and I absolutely...
absolutely freaking love this bronzer and I love to kind of put it as a highlight right here on my cheek you guys can probably see like I kind of go bronzer crazy in the summertime so yeah I I love bronzer I also love oh my gosh the wet n wild lipsticks so I don't know where oh my gosh my favorite one is in my purse and I don't even have it but this one is wine room I don't know if you can see that. This is Wine Room. Um, and this is a Wet n Wild. And it's just such a pretty kind of like pink color. And these colors are so pigmented, so moisturizing, but they have a matte kind of finish. The one that I also love is like a hot pink color. And oh my god, that's like my favorite. It is absolutely amazing. I don't know where it is. I think it's in my purse from the last time I wore it. Um, also, speaking of lips, I have been having super duper dry lips lately. I don't know why they're so dry. I've never had dry, like, chappy lips until, like, recently. And I want to say recently, like, the last, like, three months or so. Um, and it would just, and I think, this is what I think. This is who I think the culprit was. I think the culprit was Ruby Woo. Max Ruby Woo. I feel like every time I wear that lipstick, my lips break out. Does that make sense? My lips break out. That's crazy, right? So anyway, when that happened, I started using the Neosporin Lip Therapy, like uh, Lip Renewal Therapy. Um, and it's just like a white cream. And I put this on at night. It's white. You can't see it. Um, but I put it on at night. And then when I wake up in the morning, my lips are smooth and like soft. And it keeps it soft and smooth for the rest of the day. So I have been using this before as I prep my lips before I apply my lipstick. Uh, like when I'm putting on my makeup, I put that's the first thing I put on. So that by the time I actually get to my lips after I've applied my foundation and everything, my lips are nice and moisturized and really good and prepped for wearing lipstick. I have not worn Ruby Woo, so I don't know how it's gonna do with combating with the Ruby Woo. I swear, it's that lipstick. It is that lipstick because it's only when I wear that lipstick that like my lips go crazy. So, so uh, I have been loving the glowing body scrub from Bath and Body Works and this one is in Bali Mango and it smells so good. It is a body scrub and I use it in my loofah and I do it like right before I shave and after I already apply like my, I use Dove Soap no matter what I have been using that for years and then I use this kind of like as a scent and it also like is a gentle exfoliant and it leaves my skin really really soft really really smooth and smelling super duper good this also has like coconut milk in it and vitamin E and so other stuff so it is I would say this is really great I got this in two different flavors and I'm not even like halfway done with this or maybe I am just a little bit halfway done with this and I've been using this almost every day I also have to say water you guys water has been like my favorite I do not like go anywhere without water that I keep this in my purse I keep it in like it's really really weird but water does your skin a body good like does your skin a body good does your body good anyway it's amazing okay let's just say that it's amazing has my skin super duper soft and this is what I this is how I know it's the water because as soon as I stop drinking water and I start drinking juice and pop soda, I don't even know why I call it pop because I call it soda, and it just makes my face like break out and pimples and stuff like that. And I have been very, very happy with my skin lately. My skin has been smooth, it's been soft, it's, it's just, I haven't had many breakouts this summer so I am extremely happy with that and I want to say it's because of the water so in the summertime make sure you guys drink lots and lots and lots and lots of water because it is amazing for you so yeah um I want to say that is going to conclude my June favorite so far. I hope you guys like this video. Um, if you guys do, please be sure to like and subscribe right here. And leave me a comment below if you have any questions on 